Hello everybody, welcome to another vlog. So I think I might film just a couple days today, but not a full week, but not just one day because I'm working 12 till 6. So there's not going to be that much footage for today, but I have the day after tomorrow. So I'm going to Lost Vintage because they uploaded a jumper that we really want to get and a t-shirt. But I also have lots of things to do tomorrow that I bring you along. But I'm about to head to work. I have my blonde ponytail in today. So I have blonde hair for the day. Um, and I have these fierce lashes on because I felt like it. <laughs> Hello. About to go to work. Work outfit. Wearing Patagonia to work because lol. And yeah, I better go. I'm working with a girl that like I don't click with as much today. And I think I made her mad yesterday. So... Anyway, but we, we shall see. But yeah, I don't want to be late, so I better head to work and do my job. What does perfect even mean? Okay, don't mind the fun that mind the fact that I look like a mess but we were lazy and got Max for dinner so <laughs> yeah because we could not be bothered cooking <laughs> Max <laughs> yeah. I realised the lady was outside in the dog bark I was like <laughs> 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 well, I think you should eat it now mm. it no that one's yours huh? <laughs> no that one's yours no that's yours, no, that's yours. It's your one. mine's not that much better they obviously um won't pay much attention well, they're fucking working at matches. <laughs> what the heck is happening there? Mm. Good morning, everybody. So, it's the next Saturday, and my plan for today has changed a little bit. So, apparently, I have an exam this morning. Apparently, I have an exam this morning. So, last night, I got... Well, while I was at work, I got a message from my like lecturer saying that I hadn't done like the declaration for my exam. Like you just pretty much before you, everyone does the exam, you have to pretty much declare that like you're not gonna copy and paste, you're not gonna like look at your notes. I mean, this is an open book exam, but like it still has does the same kind of stuff. You're not just gonna copy and paste from your notes or from the lecture or from the textbook or whatever. I was like, what do you mean? Well, I didn't say that to her, but I was like, oh my god, I have an exam tomorrow, so. My plan for today is pretty much changed to doing my exam, which is in 15 minutes, um, but it's open book, so I've got all my notes on my computer and stuff all set up from the notes I've taken from the lectures, and I have Google Scholar up and stuff that we're allowed to use. I have that to do until 11, and then I have my assignment to do, which was in my original plan, but I don't think I'm going to be able to go out, um, but that's okay because Dylan couldn't go anyway. But what I'm thinking I might do, my exam finishes after two hours, so it'll finish at quarter past 11. What I'm thinking I just might do is slap on just like the tiniest bit of makeup, pop down to Lost Vintage anyway, just to see if they have the jumper that I really want to get Clancy, <laughs> just to see if they haven't sold out because I'll obviously be getting there late and I have a feeling that it's going to be one of the popular ones. I think it'll be good to get out after doing my exam. But I'm only going really quickly to go down and get it, maybe get a coffee, not even have my coffee in the city, just like come straight home and do my assignment. Because I'm not too worried about my assignment because I think it will be pretty easy. Not easy, but like it's a reflection and our lecturer has said like we understand that you will be referencing the lectures, the textbook and the notes and stuff so you don't need to specifically reference what you're talking about because we know where it's coming from because we've given you all the sources in which it's probably coming from the first reflections only like what 100 it's like 100 words or something and then we have to do the first reflection we have to answer four questions about the tutorials which is 200 words so 50 words per question which is nothing and then we get three scenarios that we have to write 350 words back which again is like a paragraph so I'm not too worried about it it's not due until 9 p.m. tomorrow so if I can do that today while Clancy is at school a little bit in the morning before I go to work I will be happy so yeah that is my plan because I still really want to go to Lost Vintage and, and get this thing yeah I don't know if I should have like the quickest shower before this starts like the quickest shower 
yeah okay let's let's quickly have a shower okay so i just had the quickest shower and i even managed to put on just like the tiniest bit of makeup that i felt a bit put together i've got my laundry jean active wear on i mean i'm wearing a blanket because it's cold but it's now 15 let's do this <laughs> Okay, so I don't really have anywhere where I guys can I can put you guys that you're gonna be able to see. Like everything's kind of in the way, but I ended up getting it. <laughs> I thought they were gonna be sold, like I thought they would have sold it because it's a really nice jumper and it's more of like a universal style vintage piece. Like it's Adidas, like it looks like it be could be sold like now rather than being like i guess truly vintage so i thought that would be popular but i went and got it after my exam um my exam went well i i mean it was open book so i wasn't as stressed as like i could have been um purely because like i could look at my notes and all of that kind of stuff but yeah feel good i'm gonna have a quick walk around the center just like refresh before i go home and smash out my assignment um but i'll I'll show you that when I get home and I also got a coffee I got a vanilla latte and I'm loving my choice because it's made it a little bit more sweet which I like oh my god but it is so hot today we've literally had like four days in a row where it's been freezing and raining and I wanted to not go outside and crawl up in bed and stay there all day because it's been so cold but today's so hot oh my god okay I'm gonna go park in the center now. Also, I did a really good parallel park. I put a photo here. I was pretty fucking impressed, actually. I did a really good job. But okay, I'm gonna go walk around the center. There's a couple of things I wanna try on, but I definitely am not getting anything because money. <laughs> I don't wanna spend money. Okay, let's go. Okay, I am home. Let me just turn some lights on. That did nothing. Okay, so I'll just quickly show you this jacket that I got. This is what it looks like. It's got the Adidas in the middle. It's a size medium, US medium. So that should be good. Me and Clancy can, can swap between wearing this. I got it so that we could share it um, because I saw it on the website and Clancy likes things that are like central and in the middle. He probably would like it if the Adidas was a bit smaller, but I don't think he's going to mind because it's like in the middle and it's like kind of this gray or grayish bluish color with the white. And then it's got kind of paneling on the front and the back of the sleeves that kind of goes down each side and then it's just got a little adidas logo on this sleeve as well i got it i thought this would be really popular but obviously i was too fucking quick so i wonder if anyone's gonna go in there wanting it and um i have it so let's put it on and not get makeup on it like the first time i ever worn it okay it's really oversized on me but i like that which also means that it's probably going to fit Clancy as well. So this is what it looks like. Oh, I actually really like it. Oh my god, I'm definitely going to need to do a photo or something in this. Because, oh my god. Oh my god, look at my little no-handed sleeves. This is so cute. Whew. And I know I said it was like really, really hot before. But apparently that was like just in the city. Because I got home and I feel like it's cool enough to wear a jumper so i'm gonna wear that while i do some of my assignment and i also just got this little like capricorn necklace as well i don't know if it will like focus on it i thought that would also be really cute as well to wear with my gold earrings that i got from there when i went with dylan excuse me that was disgusting <laughs> and then I ended up getting these. <laughs> I know I said that I wasn't going to buy anything, but I tried them on and I was like, Adidas, like why are you going to do this to me? I did try on the white pair because I went in looking for the white pair because I saw them at Hype on my break yesterday. Um, let me see if I can find my Adidas shoes. And the reason that I didn't end up getting the white ones is because I already have these in white and 
Like they're not the same, but they're similar. Not gonna lie, like they both have this triangle detail at the top. I mean, this one's more on the side. I already have these in all white. I already have these in all black. So I thought, probably shouldn't get the white because they pretty much look the same when they were all white because all of the detail in this is gone when it's all white and you can't really tell. Yeah, I really liked this color. And I don't have anything orange. And you know what? I'm really excited to wear this with my Lorna Jane leopard black and white print. I think that will look, what? I think it will look really cool. Um, but these are the comfiest shoes I've ever worn. Okay, so uni. But what I'm thinking is I'm gonna put this clothes rack. I might not put the clothes away away, but I'm gonna take them off the rack and fold them, put them on the table. And put on some washing and do some uni and then put out some washing because our washing basket is full and we need to start doing the washing once it's full and not once it's like overflowing so i also need to have lunch because i'm starving i don't really know what to have um hmm i don't want to have noodles again because i had that three 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 times in my last video and you guys probably don't want to see it again you're probably sick of me having noodles but they're yummy <sighs> Oh, why do I keep burping? I had a coffee today and that was it. I don't even have any leftovers because I ate that the other day. What do I have in the fridge? Ah, nothing. <laughs> no, that's because everything's just in the freezer. And the pork that we have in the fridges for tonight. I could have an omelette. I could do that with some capsicum, broccoli, salami, spinach. Let's do that. Let's do an omelette. Okay, what order am I going to do things in? Put the washing, fold the washing put the washing on, or put the washing on, fold the washing, have lunch, put the washing out, start doing uni. Yeah, that's, that is the order that we're gonna do this in. So, oh, but for that, we're gonna put music on because that will help me be productive. Where's my phone? You know what is actually really productive to listen to? Hamilton, which you guys probably get sick of me talking about it so much, but one, I love it, and two, they pick the right songs, listening to Hamilton at the gym, Oh my god, like I was on the elliptical the other day listening to my shot and I was just like now throwing away my shot <laughs> on the elliptical. It was like going so fast and I was like ah! What other songs on there like are really good? I'll have a look. Oh, someone wants to send me a message. Brandon. Do you want to be a brand ambassador? No, I don't. <laughs> Grow up to be a hero and a scholar. The ten dollar found a father without a father. Got a lot further by working a lot harder. By being a lot smarter. By being a self starter. By 14, they place him in charge of the trading charter. Grow up to be a hero and a scholar. Grow up to be a hero and a scholar. Grow up to be a hero and a scholar. Okay, so I'm definitely going to have to do um, a couple washes because, I mean, I said before we needed to do our washing before um, the basket overfilled, but it's overfilling. These are our dressing gowns, which are like towel dressing gowns, and mine is incredibly dirty because, unlike Clancy, I wear, that's bad lighting, I wear makeup and fake tan. I need to wash those really, really bad, and there's a couple other towels in there, but there's literally only like four things in there. Um, and I'm gonna have to do a heavy wash because they're like cars and stuff. And then I also have to do all this. Okay, not that I, not I don't know if anyone cares. Um, <laughs> But if you want to know how to put in my omelette, I have three eggs, mushroom, red capsicum, broccoli, I'm going to put some spinach and some cheese in it, and then just salt and hot suppressor salami. So that's kind of like what it looks like in there. And then I always put like butter on the pan. Make it nice and buttery, I guess. <laughs> Okay, hi everybody. Don't mind the fake tan. Um, it's Thursday today. It's heading day. Um, it's actually quite a few days later. It might even be a week 
also i'm not sure Ugh. My battery is splashing. Maybe I should use my other camera. Okay, I just decided to use my other camera because my battery is splashing. But yeah, it could even be like up to a week later. I'm not sure when like I actually last filmed. I thought I would just do a quick update and I also just went to Priceline. So I just thought I'd do like a quick makeup haul before I like end this video. Okay, so pretty much I did my first exam. And I think it went like okay i think it went all right i did some revision and there were lots of questions i knew there were a couple i didn't know but i'm feeling a little bit more confident about it and i have a whole week until my other exam so i have a whole week of study to prep for it and it's only weeks 7 to 12 that are ex accessible um and not the whole semester like not the whole 12 week semester so i'm happy about that but i wanted to show you guys what I got. Apparently today was the day to go because they were having like a sale which was really bad actually because I was kind of just picking stuff off the shelf and then I just ended up like paying for it. I didn't even end up getting like that much stuff. So I went in for the tattoo brow because I wanted to dye my eyebrows because obviously my hairs are like a lot darker now so i wanted to get the tattoo brow to kind of dye my eyebrows so i went and got that and i also got some more of the l'oreal root catch up spray and i got it in cool dark brown because as like my hair's grown out so like my extensions are so grown out which obviously means my hair is growing but my natural hair color is a lot more orangey than like what it got dyed as you guys can see so i got the cool dark brown because i just want to touch up a little bit of the orange and make it obviously like less orange i got a lot of like doubles of things so i went in and i got some of the maybelline superstay matte ink um liquid lipstick i went in purely like thinking that i was just going to get the brown like I swatched them on my hand because I've been on the hunt for like a real brown lipstick and not just like a pinky brown, like a real brown. And I saw the red and I never wear red lipstick, but I wanted to get it. I wanted to find somewhere to wear it to, step out of my comfort zone and go for something red. So I got those two. Then I also got two of the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop concealers. So I got them in the shade True Beige and Neutral Beige. So you guys can see like they have a little bit of a color difference to them but i got the lighter color and the dark a little bit of a dark color for when i'm like not as tan and i look i'm like a little bit more tan because these are normally like 15 or like 16 bucks or something but they're on sale and they're like seven so i was like oh i'll get those i also just got this um Rimmel 100% waterproof mascara because i recently got my eyelashes like lifted and tinted but you can't like really tell so i've been using an eyelash curler as well which has really been helping but my normal mascara like can't hold the curl but um obviously everyone says that waterproof mascara will help hold the actual curl so i don't have any waterproof mascara so i went and got some to see if it would work because i went and got my eyelashes and stuff done i thought because i i have had them done before and that was kind of before i started doing like extensions and like all that kind of jazz with my eyelashes so they were super super dark and super long and i was like over the moon about it but when i went and got them done the other day like you can tell that like they're standing up but they're just like not as impressive as they were before i was starting getting extensions and i think that's because like when i get sick of my extensions i like pull out all my eyelashes um and that's why they don't look as good this time so i actually ended up getting two different eyelash serums so i got the l'oreal clinically proven lash serum so it contains castor oil vitamin b amino acids hyaluronic acid i don't know how to say that word and i don't know how to say the other word at the bottom so i got that one there and that was just like a little tip one that you like put on your lash line but i also got the maybelline lash sensational boosting serum um which is like a brush so you brush it through so i'm hoping like combining these two i can grow my lashes back um and i think i'm gonna like try and stop getting extensions and just like doing lash lifts and stuff but not all the time and if I grow my lashes and I have my eyelash curler and my waterproof mascara, 
I'm hoping maybe I can just stick to doing that rather than all this stuff that ruins my lashes. So there we go. <laughs> but that was my little Priceline haul and I really hope you guys enjoyed the rest of this video as well. If you did, make sure to like it down below as well as subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already as well as check out my other day in my life videos or if you want to check out some of my other videos, I have like makeup videos and haul videos and stuff. Um, all those playlists will be on my channel as well. And if you want to follow me on my social medias, everything will be linked down below. But I am the most active on my Instagram and I'm also trying to like change out my Instagram and do more like influencer, more influencer less blog type Instagram. So yeah, uh, follow me on that. But that is it for me for this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Trust, yeah. No, I